And welcome back to All Over the Map. Thanks for tuning in. On this episode, we're going to play an urban world by Mapper. Explore the cities of the world, 2,600 plus locations in more than 600 cities from all continents are currently available. We're going to play this as a no move. I think we're going to do a two minute. Uh, yes, we will do a two minute no move game. We're going to invite you to play along. Uh, the link to the play along is in the description below. If you hit the like button, smash the subscribe button, and share this with your friends, it would be appreciated. Okay, so what do we have here? We have what looks like Portugal from the road signs. Interesting traffic light. I don't understand why they wouldn't put the arrow on that one, but that's besides the point here. Got a limited amount of time. Okay, so we've got... Okay, the... Okay, so we're in Portugal. Not sure what to have made sense out of that one. What do we have here, Lucia? Can't really make this out, unfortunately. I'm sure you might, Lucia. Can't really see there. That much help. Cardiologist, the gastrointestinal, like, this is the doctor here of some sort. Um... Well, I can't make that out. Hilly city. Let's take a look again. Um, look at Coimbra. That's where I'm thinking. Don't think we're Porto. Del Yeah, I'm going to have to just go with that. Not really sure on this one. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. What what a guess, at least for me. Holy crap. Wow. Well, wow. I just thought, what is the largest city outside of Lisbon and Porto? Because it didn't look like it was near the water. And lo and behold, in between the two is Coimbra. So that was a fantastic 776 yards. One of my best guesses. This is, that's an insane guess for me. I'm sorry. That's a good one. We get off to the next round. We'll come back and actually look at the location at the end. And here we are. Oh, boy. Um, South Africa. So we're at the University of the Witwatersrand. What the hell? What a name. Propertuity. In South Africa. Now we just got to figure out why all this blue is showing up there. Um, where the heck we are? Mabaneng, Seifert Road, Constitution. Okay, so let's look at Pretoria. Maybe that's where we are. Oh boy. Um, Right. Does that say Constitution? I don't know what that says. Const uh, hold on. Yeah, Constitution. University of the Witwaters Rand. University of the Wit. Maybe not here. Not really sure on this one, folks. Um, 13 seconds. But uh, I'm just going to guess there, Pretoria. Okay, so we were in Johannesburg. So we're 32 miles. Not too bad. 
4,823 points. Decent score. Uh, had more time. Probably could have figured that out. So we're in France, obviously. Palm trees. So we're probably in the south of France here. Much there. Don't smoke, folks. Especially when you're driving. I guess you could, but not telling you what to do, but I wouldn't do that. But uh Oh boy, where where do we go on this one? We got crying kids in the background as usual. Sounds like a, uh, I've got a kid that is afraid of the thunderstorm. So I don't know if thunderstorms in the way, but that's what it sounds like. So Kathy, uh, just not enough clues. It's a hilly location. There's palm trees who so are probably in the south of France. I'm just going to go in and start looking. Maybe we're either in Montpellier or Marseille. Um, if we look south... Sure, there's a clue. Probably right here. Um, let's go on, Pelier. Let's go in here. I think we're probably let's just see here. Maybe not. No, we were 288 miles away in Bastia, Corsi. Interesting. Okay, well, that's a decent round. 288 miles away. Probably wouldn't have gotten that one. Somebody I'm sure will probably see that I missed something there, which I probably did. But in these quick rounds, wow, look at that. You don't want people hopping home to home, I guess, up there. Um, hmm. What am I thinking here? Here we go. Okay, so we're in Greece, is what I'm guessing. You ever wonder, like, these folks that put potted plants here, if, you know, you, you go to reach to get something, it knocks it off. I mean, I, I can't imagine that. Um, I'm guessing Athens, you got folks that are airing out their clothes there. It's an interesting landscape, to say the least. But I'm curious more about this. I guess you got in this, this guy sees, sees us there. But you look up and you see people hopping. I guess they hop from building to building. I don't know why they would have that up there. There's a stop sign. Is this really Greece, though? Twenty-two seconds. I'm going to go in to maybe we're Thessaloniki. Just going to guess here and hope for the best. <laughs> oh my God! Another insane guess. I, I, I Okay, so the thinking behind this one, holy man, I, 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 I am floored on this. I mean, maybe it's the kids crying in the background. I don't know what the hell it is, but another insane guess, 481 yards. Okay, here's why I went to Thessaloniki at the last minute. I was thinking Athens, but I'm like, okay, the last round, we were at a small city. I'm, I'm guessing Mappers probably put in a lot of smaller. So, so maybe it's not the obvious. Oh, my God. Insane guess number two of this game. I don't know if I can get any better than this one. 481 yards near the urban donkey. 
and the Church of the Holy Apostles in Thessaloniki. Man, that is, I should just stop playing. On to the next round. Man, I'm just uh, floored by that one. I'm just kind of stunned myself. Okay, so we got a flag here. I'm guessing this is Romania. Uh, and we are at Street Barbu La Taru. Guy looks like he's redoing his home. Says something not to do there. Don't go down this street. There's Stag. The Expert Network. So he says, please take my trash, even though I, the bin isn't closed. Okay. Um, do we go with Bucharest or do we go with another city? Now, my mind says we go with Bucharest, right? That's what would kind of make sense. I'm not thinking that might be the case here. I don't know what any clues we have other than the flag. Okay, they're going to tow your car if you park there. We're on Street Barbu La, La Toru 26, but I don't know if this sign is unique to a city or you see those signs in every city. In, and I don't know where the expert network is. But on a hunch that we're probably not in Bucharest, could we be in Brasov? Or, let me just think about this. 26 is the street number. Brasov, could we be in Cluj Napolka? Perhaps. Maybe this is where we are, Cluj Napolka. It's either that, I don't think it's or Timisora. No, I'm gonna go up here. I, I'm just gonna guess here. And no, we weren't. We were actually on the other side of the country in the town of, uh, forgive me for saying this, IEC. Uh, IAC. IAC. What do we get? We got 22,438. The one round that threw us off was the one in France. Uh, the biggest miss. But some insane guesses on this one. Coimbra. And what? <laughs> We were that far away, that's insane, on Miguel Torga, there. The second round, we went off to South Africa, and we were a little distance away. We chose Pretoria, but we're actually in Johannesburg there at the Empire Road, near the Wits Rugby Stadium. The third round, we went off to France, and we missed that one. We thought we were Montpellier, and we are actually in Corsi at Bastia, right there, near the Homeburger and Tacos. The fourth round took us off to what was a fantastic, insane guess in Thessaloniki, Greece, where uh, I can't believe I got that one. That was insane. Great guess there. And the last and final round took us off to Romania, thanks to in part really to the flag there of Romania that was there in the background. And we were IEC, which we were near on the Strada Barbu La Taru. <laughs> and there in the background is a KFC like normal when I play this game. So as always, thanks for tuning in. This, this urban world will probably be a no-move game. We'll probably do this several more times. This is a fun one. Um, let me know in the comments below if you actually enjoy playing the urban world. I like this one. I like the no-move. Maybe do no-move, no pan, no zoom. One of the games. But this could be a series. Uh, comment down below if you'd like to see this as a series. I'd like me to play more of the games. Ultimately, I'd love to see if, can get, if it's possible to get as close to a perfect score on this. 22-4-3, uh, a great score for me. Two insane guesses in this game. I appreciate each and one of you tuning in and subscribing. Let's get to 500. As always, thanks for tuning in. Until next time, cheers.